Hello and welcome to a new YAM video. In this case, we're going to explore the early game, how to start uh, with YAM. So we'll go right ahead. Um, there are a couple of options usually, uh, but you, what you want to focus is trying to get at least two ones and start going down. Uh, in case you cannot do it, you can call something or play this one as an lap, a last option to try to get um, YAM. Uh, if everything else fails, if you don't get anything good, you can always cross up, cross out YAMP. So we're gonna demonstrate it. So I get one YAMP, uh, so I get one one, <coughs> um, and I usually always go with ones. I don't take anything else unless I get three same, three same uh, numbers, let's say this is a six, or a one, then I would take sixes, otherwise uh, I'll always go for once. Two ones, it's good enough. And then we continue with the game. Twos. You get the idea, you can progress. It's a nice early, early start. An excellent early start. And now we hit the end. We don't have the fives yet, so now we can just call something, um, or we can always try to get jump, which is very hard. So the safest option is to call twos, unless I get jump now. Okay, I didn't. Now that's an amazing one. <clears throat> call poker. You get it, I think. And let's try one more time. We got two ones, nothing much to think about. Just go ahead and try. We go three ones, you know, you know this one. In case you don't get two ones, which I did. Alright. So in case you don't get two ones, what do you do then? Huh? That you can take one of these. Uh, you can take two twos. You can get one of these basically. Two threes or two twos are okay. Or you can cross this one out. If you get three same, of course you can take this. Uh, my advice would be pretty much always take uh, zero yump, simply because you can progress more. And then the game continues. Uh, in case you don't get any yeah, uh, ones in the beginning, uh, usually you should either call or play this one. Sometimes you will probably have it already called and you still didn't cross the amp, so you cannot uh, play um, this one right away in case you try to get... Right now I can try to get poker, right? But in case you didn't cross the amp, you cannot. So let's go ahead and call twos. Let's go ahead and call three. So you can also, so there's two options. You can not call or call. You usually save calling for when you get um, three same. If you have this kind of situation, you if you get two same on these high numbers, and then it's very risky to call them because in case you don't get them, you kind of messed up your your line, line here. So uh, you kind of when you get only high numbers with two of them, you're kind of forced to play, play like that, like so. And now if you don't get anything like this one, you don't take two fours. Uh, you usually go for one of these. So two threes is a better option because that way you will uh, have more chance of getting more points later. Now we have the same problem. Uh, no three. There are no uh, three sixes yet, so if you, that's a very risky move. So instead, we try this one, and we got lucky this time. We get poker. If you don't, if you didn't get, if you don't get anything, you can write this one. In case if you get only two sixes and nothing else, then you take when then you cross poker and you go up. All right, we finally got one one. So let's see if we can get two ones or not this time. 
there you go. And now the game continues. So let's demonstrate this. It seems like a very hard, difficult game to start, so let's demonstrate how to handle such a game. The focus remains only on going down. So if, if you get one, three at least, if you get one number, go down. Don't call this because it's the same situation. You need to get uh, three fours at least for the points and it's a very tricky one so just play it safe. If you get points you take it, if you don't get just take this one because it's all about progression and this looks very tough to do. You don't even have this. You c their options are you can call Yamp, you can try to get full which is very hard. Yeah, you can. These are two two options. You can try to get full, and then if you don't, you can cross this one, or you can try to get young. So let's do the other one. Let's call. And now this is a new chance, and then finally we can do something with this one. We can call. There we go. This one is pre This one is amazingly secured. We got super lucky. Um. We could try for full, but it's, again, it's very hard. However, this time there is a difference. Since you got so many points here, thanks to this one, now we can freely call. And this one will be pretty much secured, even if it's you don't get any more. This one is very much awesome. Um, that's a poker, first try. That's a full first try. There's two options, you can take this one or this one. I actually think this one is also, these are both good moves. I'm not 100% sure what should I do here. Hmm. We're gonna do this, we're gonna call full and then we're gonna try to get this full and in the meantime we're, we're, gonna, we're gonna cross these. So let's go ahead and do that. We do have three trees, but we don't need poker. But if you want to get full, you're, trying, you're tr always trying to get um, two and two, like a two pair, but there's no two pair here, there's only, this is a pretext to poker, which we don't need, we need full. So, you can go and get yourself a poker, perhaps you get it, perhaps you don't, if you don't get it, you're kind of screwed. So what, we would, what we're gonna go is go back to focusing on this one, instead. And now we get two forces mech, but we get this one, which is quite huge, because we can progress now. And we got this one. Now this is very tricky because pretty much everyone would take this one and go up. But this one, remember, is very very hard to get. So what you can do is you can call and then later on we can try to call this one. Try to just get this one. But let's reverse this one. Let's try and go up right away. And then let's later try to call this one. We got one four. We got 46, which is okay, not the best, but let's get rid of the straights. They're pretty hard to get. Thirty-nine. We need four sixes, which is very hard. So we're probably just going to progress. In case we get lucky, we get lucky. If we don't, we don't. So there's. There you could, I could play this one, but it seems a bit risky, and you cannot play this one. So I'm gonna call force. Just delay, there you go, much better start. 11, not the best. And this one is pretty low numbers, but there's not much else we can do. So I'm kind of, we're kind of forced to take play this. Like for example, if we throw this one, it's gonna be higher, and it's even worse, so we're just gonna play this one. Now, we could play maximum, but I really hate playing ones, so we're gonna play ones. Four ones, awesome. Now we play the maximum. Take the four on the second row. 22. So there's another question, which one should I take? I can go down, but if I take this one, then uh, the next one is sixes and or maximum so there's both choices so this one is quite better because it allows you to get this and now you got two options you can play both just sixes or maximum well 
very good. 12, not the best. 33 is meh. Quite also, so... Let's go ahead and take 12. Now we're gonna get the maximum. Now that's a good minimum, but um, four, four ones is very hard to get. Extremely hard, so that's an easy choice of uh, ones. So we're gonna go up now. First try, we did get it. So we got another straight, which is excellent. Straights are hard to get. Now we're just gonna try to get go up. Regardless of that pool, it's not the best numbers, so. That is an excellent uh, maximum. However, this one is much harder to get. Too bad we didn't get the fourth one. Wait, I wanted to secure it, but that didn't happen. Now we can get maximum. We don't have to waste three sixes on a maximum, so instead we're just gonna get this one. Now it's still alright to try maximum. And it's still quite a decent one. Twelve, not the best, not the worst. And now we have opened up this one. We do also have this option now, which is quite tempting. Let's go ahead and go up regardless. And now let's focus more on points. 58 is quite amazing, but 28 is extremely high, so this one will be chosen. We have an excellent setup for minimum. This is an okay option. If you don't get a straight, you can take minimum or you can take uh, twos. So let's give it a try. And we got the we got the straight, the best out of the options. Now we try for an amazing full. We got it. Now let's see what this minimum can bring. Nine points only, that's quite amazing. And now, unless it's four fives, we're gonna go up probably. It is four fives. We don't need straights anymore. We figured we finished that one up. So, what we wanna do is unlock this slot. That is quite a waste, that's a shame. Now this one is unlocked. Let's see what can, it will bring, two ones. There is three ones. We don't have to play ones anymore, awesome. Now we're just gonna fill all of these up. This is, this is well played strategy, so now we just have to pick whatever we want. If we get lucky, we get younger. And uh, let's get rid of all of these now. I think, yeah, we can get away with this one, perhaps. And this one's very hard, let's try to get two or twos or fives. Three twos, that's quite good. We need four, four fives, we did get it, amazing. And now we try to get poker, probably gonna cross yams, but let's, just, let's see if we can get the poker as well. We do. There you go. And remember how we rough how the game started and we still came on top with quite a huge score. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and see you soon.